The split jump anterior lunge is the counterpart to the split jump anterior reach. In this case, however, the quadricep is going to take most of the hit. We start with the split jump, making sure we try to get as deep a split jump as we possibly can, keeping our hands on our hip and our shoulders calm. Then we progress into a lunge. It's very important that as you do an anterior lunge, that you contact the ground first with your heel. Our heel was designed to be a larger bone. Therefore, it can take the ground forces more effectively, and you need to make sure that as you teach clients to lunge, they definitely impact the ground first with their heel. In slow motion, you'll see the amount of ballistic uh, activity going on with a split jump. This is a very grueling exercise and should not be used with beginners. This is not used until people have done an effective six to eight week program with lunges and are demonstrating good lunge control as they're performing those activities. The lunge in this case actually acts as a recovery. Uh, we utilize the lunge in this workout uh, to offset the aggressiveness and the, the uh, intensity that comes with doing split jumps. Remember the number one rule of a lunge, wherever you go out to, you always got to get back to where you started.